Today we're breaking down an efficient warehouse routine. We're gonna go through specific times and tasks and explain why this order can work for you. Bright and early, 7 a.m., you're going to create a plan. Starting early gives you a moment to review yesterday's data while planning for today, which helps set the tone for the rest of the day. You also wanna be planning for the upcoming shipments and deliveries that will be happening on that day. As your team comes in for the day, make sure to have a quick stand-up meeting so that you can make sure all assignments and priorities are understood, assigned, and known to everyone in the team. This early communication helps prevent confusion and prioritize needs. 8 a.m. is receiving and processing. You want to start with the incoming shipments. Why? Well, by receiving the day's new inventory, you can immediately update your accounts making sure that you are accurate and ready for all the orders that are coming in. 9 a.m. Quality control. This timing ensures any issues are caught before the items are stored or shipped out. 10 a.m. Update inventory. Use this hour to update your inventory management system because accurate data is the lifeblood of proper processes and operations. 11 a.m. Order fulfillment. With updated inventory and also making sure orders are in place, you can confidently start the picking and packing process to make sure that everything you need is ready to send out for the day. This timing allows most orders to be ready for the typical afternoon courier pickup. And then somewhere in there, you should probably have lunch and that's up to you. 1 p.m. Optimization hour. Post-lunch is a perfect time for those tasks that need some maintenance to their update, whether it is helping update a little bit of the warehouse layout, or even something as simple as updating a forecasting report. 2 p.m. Maintenance check. This timing allows for any minor repairs prior to the late afternoon rush of shipping, and also keeps everything in order and working for the next day. 3 p.m. Shipping rush. Focus on ensuring all outgoing shipments are processed. This time of day is typically when couriers make their final pickups. 4 p.m. Reconciliation and reporting. End your day by reconciling your inventory while also preparing your reports. With all daily tasks hopefully complete, your numbers should be accurate. 5 p.m. Review and improve. Spend the last 30 minutes reviewing the day's performances and any issues that might have cropped up and prepare for the following day. This process is very helpful for continuous improvement. Now remember, this schedule is just a framework. You can adapt and change it to your specific needs and every business is different. The key is in maintaining a logical flow that helps you and your organization maintain consistency. By following a structured routine as closely as you can and as situations permit, you're gonna help your entire business and your own day run more smooth. Here's to your success. Thanks.